The sidewalk in Canton is being uh, ready to use, well, it is ready to use by now. This comes after years of planning. Partnership to uh, work with the city to make sure that children can walk to and from school safely. Top News Anna Farish was at the ribbon cutting and found out how important a sidewalk can be. Sidewalks aren't very common here in Canton, and that can be pretty dangerous, especially if you're a student or teacher walking to school. But now that's all changing one concrete slab at a time. An 11 year project in the making is finally over. The work is certainly exquisite, uh, it's beautiful, it's, it's, it's safe for our children. This is all part of Canton's Safe Route to School project. And with safety as the number one priority, this 4,400 foot sidewalk stretches down George Washington Avenue, connecting Nichols Middle School and McNeil Elementary. We have a total of 200 that will walk to and from school each day. If it's raining, of course, the numbers decrease, but on a daily basis, maybe about 300 of my students walk home. School traffic was also an issue. The traffic will be a smooth breeze now. They won't have to slow down as much because the students will be on the sidewalk. It brings my heart peace just to know that our students could safely get to and from school. We've always walked our students to some point home, but now it gives us peace once we leave them uh, physically that they still have the ability to safely make it to their destination. The money for the near $1.2 million project was granted by MDOT and was also put together with the help of the Federal Highway Administration. And Mayor Truly hopes that sidewalks become a normal site here in Canton and that it doesn't take another 11 years. In Canton, Anna Farish, 12 News.